Frank Bushmeyer was a waste gunner with the 100th Bomb Group, flying missions over some of the toughest targets in Europe, including Regensburg and Berlin. In July of 1944, during a mission to Merzburg, Bushmeyer's B-17 was shot down and he was captured by the Germans. We were on the bomb run and flak all around and flak hit us a little bit. I knew the plane was coming from the tail end, so I was watching. He came right up over the, the left stabilizer. He got right behind. I couldn't get a shot at him, and that son of a shot us down. Then all of a sudden, we went into this flat spin, so we crawled across the floor. Sprague grabbed the emergency cord and pulled, ripped it, and the door flew off. Now I was right in the doorway, and I stopped to get the breath of air, and it was probably hit me in the ass with his big boot, and I went. <laughs> Bushmeyer bailed out and was injured as he landed in a shallow river. He was captured and taken prisoner by the Germans, while other crew members were lynched by angry civilians. So I was there for a while, about an hour, and finally a khaki shirt came in there and says, come. I says, come what? Come, go to the hospital. If you're not taking the hospital, you're gonna take me out of the woods and shoot me. And I really felt he was. And so the march is down this dirt road, and uh, all of a sudden I saw, here and there, I saw a rooftop, a guy with an arm off or leg, or, well, maybe they're taking him to the hospital. And they did, they took me in there, and after they fixed that, they took me in there, a war room with all rooftop of pilots. I'm sure they felt, we know what we went through, we're pretty sure what you went through. It's over and done with, that's it. There's no animosity there at all. After Bushmeyer's injuries healed, he was imprisoned in a German POW camp where he remained until the camp was liberated in 1945. 